Will Smith barred from attending Oscars for 10 years after SLAP. So the Academy Award has finally came out with their decision. They have decided that Smith, who won the Best Actor this year, could still be nominated for Oscars, industry officials said, but will be unable to attend Academy Award ceremonies and other events. In an article written in the New York Times, Nicole Sperlin states, the Academy of Motion Picture Arts and Sciences said on Friday that Will Smith would be barred from attending the Oscars for 10 years because of the harmful behavior he displayed when he struck the comedian Chris Rock during last month's ceremony. The ban came a week after the actor resigned from the organization following his violent outburst on Oscar stage on March the 27th. In an open letter released after a morning meeting of the Academy's 54 governors, the group's president, David Rubin, and his chief executive, Don Hudson, also called Mr. Smith's behavior unacceptable and admitted to not handling the situation properly during the telecast. For this, we are sorry, said the statement. This was an opportunity for us to set example for our guests, viewers, and our Academy family around the world. We fell short, unprepared for the unprecedented. Mr. Smith said in a statement that I accept and respect the Academy's decision. The Academy declined to elaborate on whether Mr. Smith remains eligible to be nominated for Oscars, but two industry figures with knowledge of its rules and who were granted anonymity to discuss Academy proceedings said that Mr. Smith is still eligible to win Oscars, but cannot attend the Academy Awards ceremony and other events. The Academy went on to praise Mr. Rock for maintaining his composure under extraordinary circumstances and thank others involved for their poise and grace during our telecast. Representatives from Mr. Rock did not immediately respond to a request for comment. Mr. Smith had seemed to anticipate the possibility that he would not be welcome at further ceremonies and the emotional and polarizing acceptance speech he gave after winning the Oscar for Best Actor, which he ended by saying, I hope the Academy invites me back. Thank you. Barring Mr. Smith from next year's ceremony means that he will not be allowed to present the Oscar for the Best Actress upending a tradition in which the previous year's Best Actor winner bestows the prize for the Best Actress category and vice versa. The punishment could also spell trouble for the upcoming film Emancipation, a $100 million drama for Apple. The movie, directed by Antoine the Qua and starring Mr. Smith as a runaway slave who joins the Union Army, is in post-production and has already been touted as possible award contender. Representatives for Apple did not immediately respond to requests for comments. Before Mr. Smith resigned, the organization had been considering expelling or suspending the actor who walked out onto the Oscar stage in the middle of the ceremony and slapped Mr. Rock for making a joke about his wife, Jada Pickett Smith. Before returning to his seat where he shouted expletives that were bleeped out of the live television broadcast. Mr. Smith was allowed to remain in the Dolby Theater, and soon after his outburst, he won the Academy Award for Best Actor and received a standing ovation. Conflicting accounts of what happened after the outburst have plagued the Academy, which has been criticized for not immediately removing Mr. Smith from the theater. The group, in its defense, said last week that they asked Mr. Smith to leave, but he refused. The telecast producer, Will Packer, later said in an interview on ABC's Good Morning America that although Mr. Smith had been asked to leave the ceremony, Mr. Packer had urged the Academy leadership not to physically remove him from the theater in the middle of the live broadcast. Mr. Packer said that after he learned there were discussions of plans to physically remove Mr. Smith from the venue, 
he approached Academy officials and told them that he believed Mr. Rock did not want to make a bad situation worse. But someone close to Mr. Rock, who was granted anonymity to speak while the Academy's inquiry into the incident was underway, said that Mr. Rock was never asked directly if he wanted Mr. Smith removed. The Academy is hopeful that today's action will put to rest this incident, which has played out in the media over the past week and overshadowed the many accolades handed out at the annual telecast. This action we are taking today in response to Will Smith's behavior is a step toward a larger goal of protecting the safety of our performers and guests and restoring trust in the Academy. We also hope that this can begin a time of healing and restoration for all involved and impacted. So there you have you guys. Tell me what you all think. 10 years, is that kind of light? Is that heavy? Um, does the penalty fit the fit the offense? Should he have been banned for life? Are you aware that there are people that have been banned for life? Can you name the, I can think of three right now that have been banned for life. Can you name the three that's been banned for life? Okay, I'll help you out. You got Bill Cosby. Um, Roman Polanski and Bill Cosby, Roman Polanski and um, the producer. I can't think of his name. Um, the white guy, older white guy. Um, geez, that producer's name. Hold on. Let me look it up. Ah, there you go. Henry Weinstein. How quickly we forget. Anyway, thank you for watching. Like, share, subscribe, comment. Live, love, laugh. Love yourself. Be nice to others. Have a nice day. I might see you around the way. Later.